Welcome grade six students. Today I'm going to give a brief synopsis of what is expected from you during the first week. To begin with, we will start with an icebreaker activity uh, so that I get to know you and you get to know me. And the objectives of the lesson will include the following. You must identify a unique characteristic about yourself and jot it down on a piece of paper. This will be explained in depth during the lesson and what is expected from you and obviously the closure of the lesson, why we're doing this. Moreover, the next lesson that will be discussed would be the rules and regulations that should be followed and abided and you must explain the consequences of breaking the essential agreement. So we're going to create an essential agreement in this lesson and we're going to focus on the following ATL skills, communication, you will do it in group work, uh, you must communicate with your peers to establish essential rules and regulations must be abided throughout the year in each and every class. Uh, thinking, creative thinking. I want you to apply your creative thinking skills in um, when creating perhaps the poster um, or the essential agreement itself. I want you to reflect your ability uh, to come up with a new design. In addition, Social collaboration, uh, because you'll be working in groups, I want you to uh, collaborate with your peers effectively in order to produce an end product that is uh, attractive and effective. And finally, the final class includes the following. We will discuss the unit in depth. It's the third lesson will be the introduction of the unit. In this unit, we will, uh, in this lesson, we will discuss the following, the concept and context of the unit, what they are and what do they mean, what do they, they, what do they represent and what is expected of you. And before I show you the statement of inquiry, I want you to create a statement of inquiry after understanding the concept and context. So I will also dedicate a classroom discussion highlighting what is a statement of inquiry and why is it important in the MYP program in all disciplines, not only in INS. Moreover, you will also practice on the following ATL skills. So social, um, social collaboration, you will collaborate with your peers, think, care and share in order to create an effective SOI statement, statement of inquiry. You will communicate effectively and you'll use your critical thinking in the sense that you're going to take the key concept and the key and the related concepts in the global context and apply them to one another as if they're an equation and create a statement of inquiry that makes sense and is representative or reflective to the unit itself. All in all, I wish you the best. And if any further questions, you will find detailed content on the weekly or on the lesson page and it is largely reflective to what we're going to be taking in class.